Okay, let's do a quick visual condition report, starting with the front end here. We've got a crack here on this housing. We've got a gash right there. You can have some rock chips kind of peppered throughout. See some gashes here on that cover. Got some cracking here on that housing as well. A little bit of fading. Of course, you're gonna have the rock chips kind of peppered throughout. You have the NT555G2 tires. That chrome wheel looks good. The face is nice and clean. You do have some hitting there in the deep part of the barrel. Of course, you're gonna have some rock chips here. Got a chip right there. Have a little paint run there. Now here on the side mirror, it is peppered with rock chips and you do have some paint transfer there and a gash. Got some paint scratches there, a chip here. Got some chips throughout the edge. See this is peppered with rock chips and you do have a gash there. Looking at this wheel, overall looks good. Of course you do have the corrosion there on the barrel. Got a faint scratch here. Comes with two tops. You have the color match top and then you have a black top. A few scuffs and scratches there. Looking at the back bumper here, those tail lights look good. That side looks nice. Here on the upper deck lid, got a couple of scratches and chips here. Some scuffs right there. Scratch here. Got a few faint scratches there and a Pretty deep scratch right there. Looking at this quarter panel, you can see this scuff here. It does not catch my nail, so it's actually pretty light. It definitely looks a little more aggressive than it is. You have NT555 G2 tires, 275, 40, 18 here in the rear, and they look brand new. The tread is amazing. I still have these little flappy pieces here. So I think these are pretty much brand new. Chrome wheels look good here on the face. Of course, they are pitted there in the barrel. You have some scuffs here on the door edge. A chip there. Some fingernail scratches there in the door cup. A couple chips there. A faint scratch. That's a deeper scratch. It does catch my nail. Another faint scratch there. few more faint scratches here. 245-45-17 here on the front, NT555 G2s. They look really good, like I said, more than likely they're almost brand new. Chrome wheel here, you can see this flaked off on the center cap, but the wheel itself looks good on that front face. And then of course you have some pitting there in the barrel. top of the hood you can see some gashes right there one of them is pretty large it's been touched up that paint color is off though on that touch up got a couple rock chips throughout got some more touch up spots there you can see that paints a little darker and I'm gonna get this side in the Sun and flip it around Checking out the interior, it is a non-smoker. That upper section looks really good. All those buttons are nice. Lower section here looks good. Now we do have some scuffs on the kick plate edge. Here on the bolster, it is flattened out just a little bit and you can see some wrinkles and creases there. Got a couple scuffs on that bolster and a few notches out of that piping there. And you can see some stragglers here. That side looks really good though. 
steering wheel looks nice. All these buttons look good. Console looks really nice. Now we do have some stains there. The rest of this looks really, really good. Here on the passenger door panel, you are missing something in there. Those buttons look good. That leather looks nice. The lower section is nice and clean. Kick plate looks really good. Got a couple small stains on the floor mat. That carpet looks really good though. You have a few wrinkles here, a couple scuffs. Got a little scuff of some sort there on the bolster, but overall that bolster looks good. You can see a couple little stragglers here. That looks good. This side of the console looks really nice. Upper dash looks good. The engine bay looks good and it appears to be all stock. I'm not seeing any upgrades. 